So I just want to walk through in this video what an HVAC contractor does uh, when they come out for a maintenance call, whether it's in the spring or the fall. HVAC stands for heating, ventilation, and air conditioning. And a trained contractor will know how to just look at your unit, assess what's going on, clean your filters, and go through several different steps to make sure that your system's running and that it doesn't cost you either time or stress in the future. So if it's fall, typically your HVAC contractor is going to come out and look at your furnace, or maybe it's all part of the same unit. But what he's going to do is first check your filters and probably change your filters if they've gotten clogged or they're dirty and they need to be swapped out. The second thing is he'll probably check the wiring and all the connections and make sure all the electrical stuff is set and doing what it should be doing. Then he'll probably check your thermostat, make sure that's all working properly. He's probably going to check your drain to make sure everything's draining properly so there's no weird buildup or anything that could clog your system. And then finally he'll check the system controls and just make sure all of that looks good. And he'll let you know then if you need to replace anything or if there's something major or he'll let you know that you're good to go and be on his way. So typically these things can take anywhere from a half hour, 45 minutes, something like that. Um, a lot of it depends on where your unit, maybe whether it's your furnace or your HVAC unit, where that's located, you know, and what they have to get to to be able to check all this stuff out. So that's what can sometimes change the length of time that a contractor might spend. Now if it's in the spring and they come out and they're just checking your HVAC unit, not your furnace, your technician's probably going to look at your condenser coil first thing. Again, they're going to check the electrical connections, make sure all that's working. They'll clean your filters. When your technician checks the thermostat, they'll probably adjust the thermostat to five degrees more or less to be able to make sure everything's running properly. And then to make sure that your unit's charged correctly, your technician's probably going to check your superheat and your subcooling. Another thing he or she will probably look at is the motor amperage on your unit to make sure all of that's set and going properly. And that's about it. If the technician found any problems in these prior steps and or something that needs replaced, they'll let you know and be on their way. So that's about it uh, for either your furnace or your air conditioning or HVAC unit. And that's what happens on a maintenance call when a contractor comes out. So by just doing this routine maintenance, usually every spring and every fall, it's just going to save you a lot in the long run as far as utility bills go and as far as extending the life of your unit. Um, if you are in the Northern Virginia area, we're HVAC contractors at Small Solutions here, and we'd be happy to answer your questions about what we do on a maintenance call. You can find us at smallsolutionsllc.com, and we thank you for watching our videos.